what is up guys it's your boy and the arts and today i am going to show you guys my 2024 sketchbook now this is the story so far of uh, this year's sketchbook i didn't show you the last one and honestly i've um i wanted to show you this one instead because i've actually improved a lot in my art and uh, let's go ahead and get started so i use this the bay fang sketchbook um I mean, all, pretty, all sketchbooks are pretty much the same. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. So let's go ahead and start with this one. Now, this is a uh, character design I actually did for somebody. It's like a character profile, front face, side face. Hey, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, what else we got here? This is me experimenting with perspective, drawing somebody from the low. Right, um, practicing my face. It's more like a feminine face, really. Uh, more views, low views, practicing my low views. I, I actually really like this, this point of view. I'm not trying to be pervy or anything, but I, I drawing it is really cool, in my opinion. More low views, using perspective, practicing. This one's really hard, just getting, you know, Especially the feet, getting the feet right. I'm not really good at drawing feet or hands. Feet and hands are, are, are just hard to draw. Now here I actually did the hands pretty good, right? Especially from high point of view, high point of view, high point of view. There we go. Um, more high points of views, giving... Um, What else we got? Oh, and Hinata, I actually, I actually drew this one. This is Hinata. Some people say she doesn't look like Hinata. I don't know why they're saying that. Uh, the feet are not good. The hands are pretty good. Everything else is good. I don't know why people say she doesn't look like Hinata, but I think she does. This is me practicing drawing my armor. Look at this. I think this armor is pretty cool. Uh, the hard part about armor is just shading it because armor is very reflective. You know? Uh, <laughs> so this is my me and my little avatar, like me on a tablet, right? Sometimes you got to draw yourself. And this is me drawing a uh, female figure with a big booty, and drawing hands and more hands, right? And this here, I'm actually really proud of this one. This is my Naruto drawing. I actually colored this. Uh, you can go to my Twitter to see uh, how I colored this. This, is really, this was really fun to draw. So it's the Naruto, the rock band. Konoha rocks, I called it. This was really fun. You got Sasuke playing the bass, Naruto with the mic, Hinata with the guitar. Yeah, this was really, really fun to draw. Man, look at that. The band hidden in the leaf. So it's cool about doing your own projects, doing fan art. You can draw the characters doing whatever you want. Your favorite characters doing, like, you know, things aside from being a ninja. It was fun. I had fun. Uh, and this one is of Nami. Yeah, this is Nami. I drew her in different poses. This is the first one I drew. Um, I actually was looking at a picture when I drew this, and this here is an, actually this. I think it was a toy. I think it was, or from the game. I'm not quite sure. But it's Nami with her blue stick. Yeah, I kept drawing her because people on social media were telling me to keep drawing more. They wanted more Nami, so I gave them more Nami. All right, and the next one, and like I said, more Nami. So this is Nami. The original character design. And this this here, me trying to draw a one-piece body, a one-piece female body type. One-piece females, they have like no guts. It's like they have like a very small waist and like long hips. Right? And they have like this super duper hourglass figure, even Nami. This is a one-piece, a one-piece character, guys. Have fun. And we got more Nami. More Nami. I kind of messed up on this one. 
I don't know why I have to join her so much. Uh, I was trying to draw Cloud Strife. Um, this did not come out very well. However, this one looks pretty cool though. Cloud Strife, Final Fantasy VII. I was trying to draw Link. I don't know why I drew him all sad. Looks kind of sad here for some reason. Uh, this cloud drawing is pretty cool. I actually colored this one as well, and I really like the perspective. Although the hand positioning not that great, but the sword go, um, zooming into the uh, to the camera really good. And I think he did a pretty good job on his hair. See, the problem I have with drawing cloud is the hair. It's like I don't really know what what's up. Uh, we just wanted to let you know that I turned on the AC. Yeah, this is slow, so I'm making a video. Uh, so his hair it goes in like a lot of directions. I don't really know Because I've seen his hair being drawn in many different ways, but like in what way like is it like because it's like going up and then like it's the the, the hairline or like the the hair growth is like backwards man, I don't know And I actually did a video of this more female figures Gotta keep studying never stop studying guys and here, this is me just like practicing my um, mouths, mouths, eyes, drawing the mouth, drawing the tongue, right, arm muscle, look at this, hands, these are the hardest things to draw on the planet, hands are so freaking hard, I can never get them right, even years later I still can't get them hard, um, uh, this, that's, this actually came out pretty good. Some of these hands look good. This, this here, right? This one came out good. This one came out good. Yeah, but hands are really hard to draw in general. It's the cloud strike pose that I could not get right. Um, oh, this over here. I actually try to draw a furry. This looks like freaking Bugs Bunny for some reason. <laughs> uh, this here is me trying to draw perspective. I think it came out looking came out looking all right a lot of detail i'm not so used to all this detail this is me drawing one of my main characters um like walking in the woods like in a forest or something these more character designs so i've been drawing this character for a while and he is like a it's like for an epic fantasy right he's he's supposed to be He's kind of like a samurai. He's got the samurai swag. He's got the samurai ponytail. But he's actually from an area, from a part of the world, where there's no samurais. Right? Right? Naruto. I was trying to draw Naruto in Goku's outfit. And I was trying to draw Naruto doing the Kamehameha wave. I think it came out alright. This one of my characters joining this pose. This is um, Kojira. No, Kojira. I think it's Mitsuwa. What the hell's her name? Mitsuwa Kojira. I forgot her name. She's from Demon Slayer. She's from Demon Slayer. A lot of detail on this drawing. Uh, well, here I was practicing drawing arms cross. Uh, hands drawing a, a, the handle of a sword, practicing drawing the mouth, and practicing hands on a sword. This one, I I'm actually proud of this. Look at that. Came out looking very decent, actually. Alright, moving on. Uh, more practicing of the mouth, side. What else we got? Me practicing drawing furries. I am horrible at drawing furries. One day I'll get good at it. This is me trying to draw a villain. Right? I'm trying to draw a villain, kind of like this captain, evil doer type of villain. Right, I, get, I drew him over here with an eye patch. Just trying to draw different versions. Because I wanted him to have a scar on his face. So I, I changed the scar from from the, his cheek to running across his face with an eye patch. I think it looks alright. I like the hair though. 
The iPad, the iPad looks cool. This China jaw looks kind of like a Griffith from Berserk. I think it looks pretty cool. The, the, uh, that line. Yeah, you know what? Maybe I will use this one. Because I like the scar running across his face and the eye patch. Yeah. Yeah, why the heck not? Why the heck not? Hands. Horrible hands. Nami. Another Nami design. Yeah, look at that. 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 And I think you guys have seen this a lot. Actually, I posted on social media. This is one of my... I'm really proud of this one because I drew the Powerpuff Girls. Because I, I drew the Powerpuff Girls twice. The first one came out pretty good. But this one looks... This one came out even better. It's after, after my improvement. You know, I drew the... Uh, I just drew them again. Uh, just in a better art style. With more detail. And I colored it. They're actually, I think they're the heading of my YouTube channel, you know, my Twitter. So, yeah, man. Check out the video of this. I'm really proud of this work. The Powerpuff Girls. I like redrawing old Cartoon Network characters as anime characters. And now, this is, um, these are characters that I created for, like, an, maybe a comic book if one day I, I make one. Right? Don't take any of my ideas, guys. Oh, and this is the, the bad guy, the villain I was trying to draw. See the scar, he's got a tattoo, a marking on his, like a emblem on his forehead. Uh, I keep redesigning this guy. I still haven't figured out like what I wanted to do with him. Yeah, we got this chick. She's supposed to be like Lulu from um, Final Fantasy X, like a magic user. Um, this is another mage, another mage. But in, in this world, in this world that I'm making, they're not gonna be called mages or wizards. I'm gonna use a different word. Right, and this is one of the characters I design. Look at that. Look at that. Alright, Starfire. Drew Starfire. She came out pretty good. This is one of my own characters. It's actually one of my own characters. Yeah. I really like this design. With the short, short pants. I like the sword. She's supposed to be a magic user. She looks a little bit kind of bland. I do like her dress though. The dress kind of looks like feathers. This is me practicing armor. Drawing armor. This pose. I'm trying to get this pose right, but I can never get it right for some reason. Uh, this is one. This is like a fire emblem type of armor. I don't like the way it came out. Let's try to draw this one. So it came out a little better. <clears throat> if you want to be a fantasy artist, you gotta practice them put them armor. All right, hear me. More anatomy. Female body. Drawing armor. This one came out all right actually. I like this armor. <clears throat> oh yes, I really like this one. So this here, check, I really like this one here. This is from a high point of view. It's like a bird's eye view. And he's holding a phone, right? He's holding a phone and the phone, I drew it in perspective. Like the, like, kind of like the little selfie stick. And it's like, you can see it pointing up. And I drew like the top of the cell phone here. This is actually, I'm actually really proud of this one. This perspective. My perspective drawing. This, I really like. Uh, I kind of drew this pose here, not sure why. This is like a, another perspective pose. Somebody jumping in with a sword. And here we have a mage. A mage type of guy. I like this design. I, I created, I drawn this character multiple times. And I really like the way he looks with the long black hair, the hat, and the feather. Smoking a pipe. Really good. Really cool character. Gonna use him in a comic book someday. This is my Cloud Strife. My, uh, I guess this is my second attempt at drawing Cloud Strife more realistically. Again, the hair. In what direction does his hair go? I can't figure that out. But anyways. Actually, this actually came out pretty good, but I did not finish it. Uh, this is me trying to draw like the Scott Pilgrim art style. I think it came out pretty good. 
over here more perspective drawings and I drew uh, actually I actually colored this one this is this Goku as a teenager teen Goku and more eye practice more figure more or more anatomy practice uh, this is actually a course that I took just practicing anatomy noses faces teeth shading the teeth right how to draw the teeth the mouth all that stuff all right look at this look at this all right practicing the arm drawing anatomy shading and after practicing this is what i was able to draw i like that this came out really nice though this here this like from the top all the way to the bottom with the sword this came out pretty pretty cool especially this one yeah take a look at this from high point of view i think i did a pretty good job actually yeah i think i did a pretty good job the hands are horrible like always uh, i was trying to draw a pose here it came out horrible oh wait a minute hold on I drew Keanu Reeves as Itachi. <laughs> Keanu Reeves as Itachi. This one was, uh, this is actually fun to do. I think it came out looking pretty cool. All right, this is me. This is supposed to be Sasuke in the Naruto, um, Naruto, uh, what's it called? The tuning exam. And also, I drew some poses here. Yeah. Poses. Poses. All right, poses. This is a ninja. Because as you guys can tell, I drew, I love ninjas. This is actually Rock Lee. This is where I got the pose for Rock Lee. Man, this sword pose here is difficult as hell. I can never get it right. I'll get it someday. This, this stance is supposed to be like a fire emblem stance here. Didn't come out very well. See, look at this. More poses. I drew the Nani from Lilo and Stitch. I colored this one too. And I uh, actually, I drew this Samurai Girl. Drew this Samurai Girl and then I started drawing more. I was trying to draw like an original character but I couldn't come up with a decent idea. And this is one of my uh, original characters. Her name is Katarina. She's supposed to be like a Christian girl. It's for like a romance comedy. Romance comedy. Right? I like the design actually. And this is her again. It's her again, Katarina. Right? Schoolgirl. Christian. Pretty fun, pretty fun. And this here, I actually like this character. Yeah, this is actually like a ninja pose. But so he's like a jumping up in the air. Uh, I think I did the legs pretty cool. Legs came out pretty pretty good. And he's got a, obviously a samurai sword here. And I didn't know what uh, kind of haircut to give him. So I just kind of gave him that like street haircut that everybody's using nowadays. This is how all the kids are styling their hair now. Yeah. Uh, do I have anything else? Nope, and that's it. That is Andy Matrix's um, sketchbook for 2024 thus far. The year has not ended, but you know, we got what, like three, four months more. Uh, so hey, if you like this sketchbook, make sure to um, hit the like button, comment below, subscribe to the channel, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Godspeed, baby.